My favorite part has been watching the reactions of women see it for the first time. Every single one of those women's eyes are dilated and they can't stop smiling. <laughs> Hi, I am Yvonne and I am one of the owners and I am a fellow crafter. I have loved to craft my whole life. One of the things that inspired me was my mother, my mother who loved to sew and I watched her sew many things for our family. When I had four little children who were all six and under and so I continued to sew and especially at Halloween. That was my favorite. I loved doing Halloween costumes and watching my little girls run around for months afterward in those costumes because they felt so pretty. Mostly the princess costumes and the Snow White costume. Two things that I have loved the most have been sewing and toll painting. Um, so I have an ultimate sewing box and I have the new dream box. I was a stay-at-home mom and I taught flute. I taught flute for 25 years in my home. I love the one-on-one. -on -one. That's just been always been my passion. I actually miss it, but I knew I had to be here. And um, sorry. <laughs> I knew that the past that I had had and the past that my husband had had, we could offer a lot to this company uh, because I loved creating. I loved all the crafts. I loved being at home. I really understood these ladies. When I met the ladies at the shows, when I would, I would see the pictures that came in of people setting it up in their room and how happy they were, I got it. I knew what they were feeling and I wanted to be a part of that. I got my first work box and I actually was really surprised at my reaction. My son built it for me and I set the whole thing up and I got everything that was all over the house. It was in my bedroom, it was in the kitchen, it was in the laundry room. Um, all my things and I had them finally in one place. And for two to three months, I would just walk into the room and look at it open. I didn't even close it. I just wanted to see that all my things were organized and I knew where they were. And I was hooked. I, I thought this is a great thing. It's also saved a lot of time. Um, just this last Halloween, I had my two daughters who were doing um, some different crafts. One did a, a pumpkin that was a Cinderella pumpkin, and she came in here, and it was really easier for her to find everything because it was all right there. And then my other daughter, she did a, um, an egg costume for her one-year-old, and it was really simple. She got in, she, she found the scissors, she found the felt, she found the glue, she, she came in and created and left. And I thought, wow. I wish I would have had this when I was younger. The more I've learned about most of the customers, there's more people like me than I thought. It's okay to admit that I created this and I, I did this Santa and I threw it away because I didn't like it and I started another one, you know? And we wouldn't be real if we didn't do that. My husband, about three years ago, was really trying to push to see if we could get a factory here in the USA, and it just didn't make sense. It was going to be so expensive. There was no way we could do it. Well, step by step, we figured out a way, miracles came, and now we have a factory that is building all of the dream boxes, all of the work boxes, all of the ultimate sewing boxes, and we're hoping in the future more products that we'll be able to add to our store down at the factory, we make one work box or one dream box or one ultimate sewing box at a time. We focus on that box and go through every single station to make sure everything is perfect, it's packed the right way, they put it in the crate, they seal it up, and every box is perfect. That's what we're striving for. We want quality, we want perfection. In fact, one of the guys teases me because I always say perfect. He says, I say that way too much. But that's what we want. We want to be able to have the customer to open up and have no problems. They put it together, they start crafting, and everything is great. As a company, we see that we can bring a community together of makers. Everybody is a maker. We've got professionals, we've got stay-at-home moms, we've got moms who carpool, we've got people who have stay-at-home businesses. When I went to our marketing team and, and they were telling us these new ideas and they came up with this idea of meet the maker, I said, what's a maker? And they taught me. They taught me that it is 
a crafter. It's just the modern day crafter, someone who loves to create, someone who loves to craft. And so I thought, let's go for it. Let's see what happens. And I loved how they have gone into these makers' homes. And that's you. That's anyone who wants to be a crafter, anyone who wants to create. That's me. I'm a maker. We just love that as a company that we can be a tool to pull all of you together.